And no, my units were not dropped off by you haul this time. I was actually kind of surprised because I was so used to orange and white. When brown and yellow came, I was very confused for a second on who that was. And then I realized it was UPS. If you don't know and you are new to my channel, Wick Tapes has some type of affiliation or something going on with U-Haul. They be dropping off my wigs through U-Haul trucks. I don't complain no more because they quick. But anyway. The first unit is this Outre Mally wig. And this is in the color number one. Again, I just freshly dyed my hair with the Beijing or Bean or however you say that. Oriental dye number one. So my hair is jet, jet black, which I like. I seen one other girl um, review this wig and she is the reason why I bought it because it looked really cute on her. So I wanted to try it plus. I don't know I was just in a let's try something different type of mood so I was like let me go ahead and try you know two units that I kind of had my eye on for a minute but was afraid to buy this one is like it's short for one it's it's short um it has like these loose waves like they just super loose comb in the front comb in the back same old, same old adjustable straps. Um, like I said, I dyed my hair. I also blew it dry with my Cricut RPM 8 brush. It has like these round bristle type of things that's supposed to help straighten your hair, you know, better than the usual comb or brush. And I can see it kind of added some more length to it, which I do like. But um, it was okay, brush. Damn. Now tell me these ends suck already. Oops. This is also a high tech heat resistant fiber unit and it's safe up to 400 degrees. So if you want to curl it, I would go for it. It's kind of, it's kind of growing on me, and I mean kinda. Also, leave a comment on your favorite edge controls, cause I've never had good luck with any edge control as long as I've been natural, and I'm not natural anymore. I'm relaxed, and I still have issues finding a good edge control. So the silk edge is straight edge control that I forgot I had is actually working pretty nicely. Shrish cough, whatever the stuff call y'all. Like when I say I look like one of them girls in you know middle school, they look like they, they know what to do with their hair. Like they came to school looking kind of a little rough, so they went to the bathroom and mixed gel and water trying to get some type of style real quick. That's the way that stuff had my edges looking, and I just didn't understand what was going on real quick like it went from like nice flat iron thick hair to like wavy crunchy hair in a matter of seconds and i'm just not with that it's just an initial review i don't remember if i said that but but the girl that did a review on this i will leave her um I will leave her video in the description bar. I went just like this, brought the hair to the front, and then I cut right, like straight across. Uh uh. Ugh, I hate that. Just to like give it kind of like a bang. So when I flip it over to the left, or flip it over to the right or whatever or vice versa or whatever I just did so I keep looking to the side you know I could have like that layered 
bang type of look. I honestly think the camera isn't doing this any justice because I'm really, really, really liking this unit on me in person. On camera, it's not picking up. The movie Carmen, you know how her hair was like in like short waves? This kind of reminds me of like a longer version of that. Like when it says get up and go type of unit, that's exactly what this is. Just make sure that your edges are like, you know, okay and whatnot and match the hair as far as like color and whatnot and you are good to go. Like.